Hello there everyone, my name is Oversoul, this is Oversoul Gaming, and welcome back to Erica. You may notice that there's no face cam in this episode, and I'll explain that in a moment, but first we must hit continue. I... there we go. I believe we last left off in the basement or something? I don't know, we went down somewhere, and we have to figure out which way we want to look. Where do we want to go? Let's check this window. Where is this a door? Where is this lead? Oh, wait! I don't think this is where I wanted to go. I should have reviewed, uh... Hmm... That's crackling and radiating. I'm not sure if I want to... Yeah, the hell with it. So the reason I not do face cam is because after editing the first two episodes of this, I, um... Okay, so this isn't what was radiating then. Must be the TV. Anyways, with the use of the green screen, causing me to just be my live-action self floating over the image. Oh, what the hell? I hope she was smart enough to duck. Can you not see through the window? Well, that wasn't smart, leaving the lid open. Evidence of our snooping. See, she continues to move along the path on her own anyways. See, I get the option of choosing the other two still regardless. Do I want to go into the crackly, flashy area, or do I want to go into the dark, spooky one? Light or darkness? Light or darkness? Light or darkness? Mm. Fuck it. Nothing risked, nothing gained. Am I right? <laughs> But anyways, it, to put it mildly, it, it really bothered me, it disturbed me, to be honest, my face cam in this game. Like, let me just pause this real quick so I can explain without interrupting myself. My face, like, floating over this, because I'm real and this is live action, it just... It, something about it felt a little unsettling. <laughs> I, uh, I wasn't a fan of it. It, like, reached that point of uncanny valley where it almost made me uncomfortable. So I'm like, no, I'm not doing face cam in any more episodes of this. Fuck that. Because <laughs> this is like a movie, you know? So it's better if we keep it cinematic anyways. Yeah, let's explore what's in here before we move on to the next room. Fear what you see, child? Memories of what happened. Wait, she seen something like this? Her head was literally right, right at the corner of the table. You didn't see her? Okay. Oh, of course we're gonna follow the old bitch! Yes! I'm snooping hardcore. I got a key to the door. Remember that lady told me? Yeah, let's open it. You can just... Uh oh. Why did it not work? It wasn't turning all the way. I did the motion it told me to, and the key, like, kept jamming or something. Was that supposed to happen?
Um, okay. Yes, it's fully up. Oh. <laughs> I wasn't supposed to put it fully up. A secret exit. How fun. One way or another, I'll have to see what's behind that door. But for now, we save our skin. You may be wondering why no trophies have popped since I started playing this, and it's not because I turned the notifications off. Apparently, in this game, all the trophies you earn in a single playthrough don't pop until the end, like during the credits. That way it doesn't interrupt the flow of it being like, say it with me now, a movie. <laughs> But let's be frank here. What video game isn't a movie these days? <laughs> Shalufa. This probably would have been better on my no commentary channel, but I needed content. After this, we'll do close to the sun. And that one will have face cam. <laughs> as soon as I hang my green screen back up, I had to take it down and wash it. Had a bunch of had some spills on it that needed attention. I was actually afraid to do it because I was afraid I was going to ruin it. It's like, can I actually wash this thing like I would clothes? Oh no! I have been spotted and now I shall be capsulated. No. A deer, a fox, a rabbit. They seek visions of the future for wealth and power. But they cannot see without a butterfly. That's why they took your mother. That's why they want you. Together we can save her. I... I, I don't... Together we can set her free. I don't know if we should. Eh... Uh, eh... Uh, do I trust you? Fine. Show me how. That was probably stupid. That was probably very dumb. <laughs> Okay, I had a feeling that was some kind of fever dream. Now I'm not too worried, I guess, about what I just did. Wait. She would tell me about the future. Wonderful things that only she could see. I'd tell her about the past. About a great priestess. Marked with a butterfly. What have you 
done to me? How did I get here? With this, your father made it. Chloroform? He tested it on your mother. He tested it on you too. Breathe it in and I can make you do anything. It's how he brainwashed us and made us his slaves. Yikes. Yeah. Well, that's something I prepared earlier. Her dad really wasn't the man she thought he was. Or was it her mom that was the bad one? My father had the oleander planted in the mother's memory. They were her favorite. You see them in my sleep? Pink petals falling. I'm taking these to Dr. Ballard. We're making perfume. Perfume. <laughs> Okay, you're showing me all these scenes I've already seen, but I don't get exactly what you're trying to tell me. This isn't some Saw-like twist where all the clues are in these scenes. He burned in that lamp, Erica. Oh, Jesus. Okay. What do you think it did to you? I get it now. Wait a minute. I'm dying. It doesn't matter. I know I'm a monster. I deserve to die. <laughs> your mother had that mark. It's why your father wanted her. It's why they want you to. A girl. To stare into the flames and see the future. <laughs> Priestess in the fire. How do you think? He was one of them. See for yourself. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Show me the secrets of the father. Your father convinced Lucian that by adding signs to ritual, they could see into the future and control it. Dun, dun, dun. Your mother was a missing piece. Son of a bitch. Your mother's alive, but she's fading. Without her, they're blind. They won't see us coming. We can end this. Yeah, whatever they're doing we in can that set hospital, her free. it is unethical as fuck. You're creepy, lady. But I feel like you're on the right side of this, so for now, cut the wire. We will trust you. Yes, we not want security camera to see. Convenient that the wire to the security camera runs outside where anyone could just cut it like that. So secure. Keep it. You may need to use it. Well, that was ominous. Do I get to stab someone tonight? Ooh, how delightful. In there. Bah! 
<laughs> Did I scare you? The medallion. This fucker never wants to turn all the way. They must have sealed it. Ah, okay, that's why I couldn't get into the door earlier Follow either. Me. a heavy knockout she didn't even hit him in the head she like punched him in the stomach or something live. he'll raise the alarm when he wakes up I, I... <sighs> you do it oh feathers in heavens that's not what I was expecting at all. I thought she was gonna stab him in the heart or some shit. <laughs> oh, she just went straight for the gullet like a fucking Christmas ham. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, that was so ominous. Like, that was so nonchalant. How? <laughs> Fuck. Oh. I can't even... What's the point of this? You can't hear what they're saying. They'll see us. Oh my god. Oh, and then the noise it made too, it said... <laughs> <laughs> Fucking... Christ. Oh. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> Okay. I'm sorry. That was almost as funny, as, like unintentionally funny, as like that neck-breaking animation from past Cure. We don't have much time. <laughs> it's just the abruptness of it. Like it's not funny that she killed the guy. It's just like how sudden and unexpected it was. You know, it like caught me off guard. <laughs> and it was so nonchalant and fast-paced. She's like, I can't do it. She's like, whatever, pussy. <laughs> Jesus, oh, no. I'm looking everywhere. What happened? You stay Where the you fuck go? away from me. I don't trust you. I know. I know you're hiding something here. I'm not hiding anything. I've been looking for you. Just, just tell me what happened. Oh, dude! You've got a fucking bloodlust. What the hell's wrong with you? Let the man talk! You killed him! He's one of them, Erica. Yeah, yeah, I figured that much, but Jesus Christ! At least let me find that out for sure first! You can't just go around you murdering him. <laughs> you have to save your mother. You have to do whatever it takes. <laughs> Take this. Jesus Christ. If you need it, use it. I don't want it. I'm not a killer. Promise me. She took the gun anyways, though. Oh, finally, one that works. Maybe I should have warned him. He was a cop. Maybe he wasn't in on it. But you, I don't know who you can trust anymore. Yeah, this this old. You can't be in here. Toby needs her treatment. What are you doing? They're looking for you. They 
found a body in the garden. I think you might be unwell. Wake her up. No, that's too dangerous. It's her treatment. You can't just pull her out. It takes time. Think of something. Once we pull the tubes out, she's going to start to fit. But I'll give her some epinephrine. It's in the cabinet. I'll have to put it straight in her heart. Toby! Run, Kirsty! <laughs> I shouldn't be here. I just couldn't leave Toby. We have to wake her up. You have to take the tubes out. Oh, she's gonna. F oh, oh, God. Why? <laughs> Do something. I kind of made my nose hurt a little. <laughs> Epinephrine, that's what she said. I believe that's what it is. Hopefully I grabbed the... Hope, hopefully she... wasn't lying to me about what to put. Damn the bitch! Okay, so it was the right thing. I get, ooh, if I had grabbed the wrong bottle, I would have killed her. <laughs> Thank God. Are you okay? Emma better. <laughs> On your way out, did you see someone? A, a woman in a corridor? No, there was just a policeman. Someone shot him. You should go. I'll get her out. We'll wait for you. You're welcome. Sundown. You traitorous fuck. Well, he was a friend of the father who was also a traitor, so. Erica? Don't you Erica me, you backstabber. What's happened? Oh, shut the it's fuck me. up. Like, you don't. Please. Whatever. Put the gun down. Yeah, I'm gonna talk to Ray out of this. Whatever's happened, whatever's the matter, we can work it out. I promise. That's it. Just talk to me. What's happening here? What are you hiding? This is a hospital. Uh, not know. down here it ain't. Still look like no hospital I've ever seen. Erica, please. This is not making any sense. Shoot him in the leg. So you stop moving. You need to calm down. You're scaring me. Good. I think you might be sick. I think you need help. I know about the rituals. I saw it. I remember. I don't understand. Rituals? You're not even a good liar. What rituals? What are you talking about? You're dangerous. More dangerous than you know. I don't believe you. I believe anything you say. You don't have to believe me. You broke in here with a gun. That you're pointing right at me, contemplating murder. <laughs> I don't think this is the first time you've felt this way. I think you need help. Oh, fuck you. We're not going that route. Are 
my God, what have you done? My mother is alive. You have to stop this fantasy. You have to let it go. If you hold on to it, you will lose yourself forever. Please. Trust me. Put the gun down. Near Green is dead, Erica. It's in your head. It's a fantasy. Um... <laughs> she can't do it, though. To play in playing in her character. We're gonna learn the truth now, though. He's gonna kidnap her and be like, You were right. Okay. I was a bad guy. If you trust me, I can make you better. I can make it all go away. No, fuck you. I don't believe I'm not you. I'm not gonna you kill you. Don't have to worry anymore. Oh no. Mm -hmm. Probably should have shot him. Shh. Erica, can you hear me? Look, Erica. Uh -oh. It's right there. Right there in front of you. See? It's magical. I think you are too. Oh shit, they got both of them. Dated, restrained, a patient or a prisoner, haunted by old ghosts, Erica remains. Fuck, I got a bad ending. <laughs> Damn it, I should have shot him. Oh, if I could go back and redo that, I would shoot him. Just trying to see how many trophies I got. I saved the girl. So, bittersweet, uh, I got prisoner ending. God damn it, I should have shot the fucker. I should have shot him. I should have shot him. Why did I not shoot him? Well, this is the kind of game that has multiple, multiple endings. So, as you can imagine, I'm going to put a link in the description and the comments down below for all the endings. If I can find it on YouTube, I'll look up a video and see if I can find it. That way you'll get to see a happier ending than the one I got. And you can sit there and contemplate all the different choices you would have had to have made to get, to get there, you know? That's good, you know. Because I'm going to do a playthrough of this again on my own. Just to, uh... Just to see... Just to see what else they get. But anyways... That's it for this Let's Play... Let me know what you thought in the comments down below. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and leave it a like, or you can leave it a dislike if you're mad at me for making a stupid choice that got us a bad ending. Ah, uh, I, I should have shot him. I should have fucking shot him. Okay, I'm sorry. Anyways, <clears throat> as always, thank you all so much for watching, and I will catch you possibly on another day, definitely at another time, and likely in another video. Okay, goodbye.
Tractors pump grill smoke and all plates cool down And the world's in the dark And the drunk trip on tire tracks scarred deep in the ground And the world's in the dark Oh
saw that man. 